Give it up. Brett. Okay. Hi, everybody. <laughs> Shockingly enough, we're family entertainers when we're not doing this. <laughs> I know. <laughs> I know. Shocking. How's it going? Yeah, yeah that's what I'm afraid of. there. <laughs> Sit. That'll do. Stay. Thank you. Stay. Good. I'm out of my head. <laughs> I mean, we're having to start the show. We've had a resurrection, a robot gone remark. And, hey, all right. How are you? Yeah. No? I'll try again. How are you? Ah, now we're talking. I, I get it. I get that, that first one. With the, do that one again. How are you? I, I, I get it. It's a little uneven because some of you are like... And some of you are like... Together? That's a weird sound and a weird feeling, I might add, to both encourage and hear uh, that sound. But I know it well. Um, I mentioned that, you know, the circus freaks are family entertainers primarily. I mean, that's what we do. We come out and we do this vaudeville stuff, but we work, we work with kids. It's crazy. Um, last week, I had what I consider a, kind of an uneven event. I was at a festival. I was encouraged and invited to come out and perform at a festival. I was like, oh, okay, this will be fun. And I went out there, and there were some moments like this where I'm very connected, and this is going really well. There were moments like you and me, which I can already see this is going to be a problem. I'm trying, no, it's on me. It's on me. I know you walked in, you don't like me, and I, I, I'm working on it. Give me, give me some time. I'm working. You're, okay, you like me now. Yeah. No, the pants and the, pants yeah, thank you. Awesome. Oh, thank you. I should probably go back and finish the show. We'll talk later. Okay. Uh, so, you know, I, I, I went out, I did the show, and, and I did my job well. You know, the, the, the throw stuff in the air and catch it periodically was, was, was that part and the silly skills part. But I just never felt like I got all my rhythm right. By the end of the night, that really grated on me. It really messed with me. There came this point where I, I was done with the festival and walked around all night and did all this stuff. And on the way, on the way uh, back, I, the, they put our dressing rooms conveniently on the far side of the entire festival. You walk all the way out and then it's time to go and you've got to go back. And remember, I've been beaten down systematically as so going, doing well, but not sure how I felt about it. And now I have to walk back through them all. Not doing stuff because I'm allegedly done for the day, but I have to walk the gamut back. So I start out like, yeah. It's late at night. It's hot. People are done seeing fireworks. They're kind of done with me. By the time I'm about halfway through, it's more like, yeah, okay, how you doing? What's up? Well, I turn the corner and I'm just like, forget, I just got to get out of here. Just keep a smile on my face and just hope I, just kind of like right now, and just keep a smile on your face. It's all going to work out. So I, I finally get to the, the kind of internal, the outside is going, I'm a performer. The inside's going, I don't know what I'm doing wrong. Damn it. And there's, there's a big disconnect. And, and then it happens. This little kid pops out. And these are, these are my, little, my little miracles in, in, in moments. And pops out and says, you were really good today. You did a good job. It's like, thank you. I have to go. And walks back into the crowd. And <laughs> my talent agent. <laughs> Listen to him. How'd you do? Well, ask the kid. He's gone. So I, you know, I'm feeling a little better. And I'm walking back. And I was like, okay, I had a show. And there was a moment that clearly worked somewhere. And I'm walking back. And this guy goes, I'm so glad I found you. I, I went looking for you out. I didn't want to interrupt while you were performing. Which they, I said, come here. And you can have both. Uh, but, it, you know, we, oh, you got it. Thank you. 
one guy in the back, he works for me, so it makes more sense. But I'm sitting there and this guy's like, I'm so glad I found you, I wanted to tell you that you, know, you were the best thing at the festival, which I was like, wow, you lie really well. And, and you know, this isn't about making me feel good. This is about he had something to share with me. And I, I felt good. I felt pumped up. And I walked back. You go backstage and you drink like two gallons of water. And our backstage was the back of this hotel. And I'm sitting in a hallway in shorts and a t-shirt and I'm bucketing sweat because I've been out in the heat all day. And it's disgusting. There's no, there's no longer this beauty you see before. Yeah. The shoes. Gone. Gone. So... But all this is gone, and I'm, I'm, left, I'm left with, <laughs> and this old man walks up to me. He's like my third miracle of the day, batting pretty well, all things considered. <laughs> he walks up to me, and he says, he says, I saw your work today, which is a key word that this is a man knows something about theater. I don't know who he is. I still don't. He says, I saw your work today, and you had to work really hard at a couple of points. I'm like, how long did you spend following me? <laughs> and I said, I, he said, I wanted to tell you that you did you did amazingly well and keep going because you're, you're going you're gonna to be great if you keep at it, which was what I actually needed because the little kid was great. That's a nice moment. They had the adult who's like, yeah, we're yeah, yeah, doing good. This guy told me, yeah, I know you had some moments that sucked. <laughs> I know. Real feedback is why we do live theater. It's why we get up here. I mean, this place was born for it. We get up on a stage. We put everything we have out for you guys. And uh, you guys put your hands together and it's awesome. There is another part of, thank one, thank you, well, thank you. Thank you, thank you. That's, I'm like, it's like the little, that's like the little kid. It's beautiful. We're done, we're done, we're done. One guy, <laughs> one of the seven Alexes in the corner. We are, we're here to get that praise, obviously, but there's another part of this. Later this evening, there's an opportunity for all of us to kind of come together and talk. It's kind of an intermission. We call it the Performer's Playground. Be gentle about it, but the feedback you have for performers is valuable. All of us on this stage want it. We want it gentle because we just got done performing and our adrenaline is pounding and we feel really screwed up. But as much as we want that little kid who says good things and the guy in the middle who says, well done, we want the guy at the end who says, okay, keep working hard and, and you know, maybe has some actual advice for us. Especially if you know something about theater, that's, that can make us go from good to great. I hope you'll become a part of this process. I hope you'll be gentle. And I'm even opening myself up to that in the coming weeks because I'm going to be performing on this stage pretty soon doing something a little more than running my mouth. So... Fingers crossed all that. In the meantime, welcome to the open stage. <laughs>